The attack happened overnight at the headquarters of the special anti-robbery squad. It's in a part of the capital city that's packed with government buildings in an area that's supposed to be secure. Residents say they heard gunfire for around 30 minutes. Police say they repelled the attack. According to some reports, several senior members of Boko Haram were being held at the base. They include the wife of the chief suspect in the bombing last Christmas of a church in Niger State, which killed at least 15 people. Boko Haram has previously struck in Abuja, hitting targets such as the main police headquarters and the United Nations. It wants to impose Sharia law across Nigeria, and hundreds have been killed in bombings and gun attacks blamed on the sect in recent months. The Abuja attack comes just a day after a double suicide bombing at a military barracks near Kaduna, which is to the north. Eleven people were killed there, and Boko Haram is a prime suspect in that incident as well. Adore Chumba, Lagos, Nigeria.